As an aspiring engineer, I really can't deny that the Indo-Pacific region is where it's at for the up and coming technologies. It's where all the innovation is being brought out recently in the world and I can see that that's where it's going in the future. So I'm really glad that the new Colombo plan set my sights onto the Indo-Pacific region in the first place because I wouldn't have known about all these things until I was there experiencing it. The reason that I chose South Korea mainly was because it has a huge electronics engineering uh, base there. So I went to the top technology university in the country, if not one of the best in the world, which was uh, KAIST. They call it the Korean Advanced Institute of Science and Technology. So I studied there for a semester and I actually did all of the major courses that I would have done in South Australia anyway. I was actually the first New Colombo Plan Scholar to take use of the business partnership between Telstra and the NCP in an internship in Hong Kong. When I came back to Adelaide after my scholarship program, they kept me on as an intern and after graduation, I started here full-time on the Gold Coast at the 5G Innovation Centre. So we do a lot of work here in anticipating what is going to be the future of the home and the workplace. So augmented reality is one thing that we see to be able to enable the workforce of the future, enabling connectivity in all places. Welcome to the 5G Innovation Centre, which is one of Telstra's ways to show customers the So even though I'm an engineer, it's really important that I'm able to communicate what we're doing here to customers that come into the centre. So I do some presentations on you know, what is connected workforce and what is augmented reality because it's not something that the everyday person understands yet. So for someone who knew absolutely nothing about South Korea before I went, I feel like now it's a huge part of my life. I feel like I'm really involved in the language, with the food, with the history, and especially now with the music and the arts culture as well. I think this whole experience has really changed my life for the better. I think I've really learned resilience and adaptability, which is something really important, especially as I head into a career in technology where I don't know what's going to be coming next. I don't know the next gadget that's going to be out. I don't know what country they're going to put me in next. So I feel like it's really set me up to just be open to anything and to be really adaptable and resilient in any situation.